Jan here in the Northview Model Shop. Um, we want to chime in on some of the Dr. Cranky videos he's been doing, uh, upstarting of the channel, in particular uh, video cameras. Um, it's the evolution of the camera in your shop that uh, that actually you don't think about it until uh, someone like Dr. Cranky brings a subject up and you sit that back and look at all the cameras that have dust on them now that are sitting on your shelf that you were using. And uh, we want to kind of kind of give you the history of what we have here. When we first up started, we started with a Nikon Coolpix P50, 8.1 megapixels, um, all kinds of stuff on the top you can run with, slow motion, um, time lapse, uh, panoramic, video, uh, audio overdub, photography. We used it all. We used this camera to its max. Like this, AA batteries, uh, expansion slot for the uh, SD card, which we used. You can see it's very well weathered with some uh, airbrush thinner and some lacquer thinner. Kind of made a mess of that. Great. Uh, what was really great about this while we're upside down here is the uh, the mount here. It's the quarter inch by 20 standard uh, thread pitch for your tripod. So we get to the tripod. We didn't have enough money, so we made one. Quarter inch plate, some uh, isolator mounts, 8 mil rod, and it's it's a quarter inch adapter tapped to eight mil with a quarter inch screw into the end of it. This just threaded on like so. We sat this down at the end of our bench. We put a little level on it. We adjusted our feet down level. Hit record. Welcome to the Northview Model Shop. We like this. This worked really, really well. Unfortunately, the videos in the early years. The color was a little dark, it was a little kind of mystique. Uh, the volume hit and miss some days. So, evolution, progression. We moved up to, my wife actually purchased this for us, and she thought it would be a great idea, and God love her, it was. Tablet. This is, uh, this is a Samsung, uh, I think it's just a Tab 2 or something. Or whatever. Anyway, Android based, uh, good video high definition video was the key here the high definition is really what uh, kind of put us into the next level um, what made these really nice and why I kind of lean towards this is a dual purpose you shoot your video we load on the computer but you can app download apps purchase apps for this I will edit from here upload from here done really nice though is this put us in the uh, realm of watching your videos upstairs in the family room, on the front porch, wherever. Um, it, it got us out of the model shop. So, you know, you could enjoy that stuff. You could uh, discuss, watch the video, text, the whole nine yards from here. So these were cool. The downside with this is that Samsung at in this generation was not known for their great, um, great, their great uh, video capabilities. Um, there was no focus. Uh, it, it did focus, you see the videos. The closer we got, the grainier the video became. The further away it was, the better the video, but you couldn't see anything because you were further away. So that's the limitations this had. What was nice though is how do we mount this up? Amazon tablet mount. Ah, which one is it right there? Really great setup. This went down and so mounted to here. Really cool. What we did too was this looks familiar to anybody like a CT who plays the drums. This is a stand for a symbol. Slide it down in this gizmo right here. Look at that. Line that up. Put her down like there. Lined up. Welcome to the Northview Model Shop. Great. We set this thing anywhere. We had it kind of pinned and tilted, getting shots like this. It worked really, really great. The uh, like we said before, the problem with there was the camera was kind of iffy. And these did not perform well in low light. And uh, the time in the shop we were in, low light was unfortunately what was. So this is where it became difficult for me because I'm very pro PC, Android, Windows based programs. I get handed an iPhone through work. So it had video. I knew that. We used the camera. We used the camera a lot. It became to the point where the only time we took video or uh, photography was with this because the pictures was, you know, it wasn't even comparable to the to the Samsung, and uh, it wasn't even in the you know the the Nikon camera wasn't even close to getting the quality that the handheld um, 
cell phone. And this was always charged, it was always at hand, and I wasn't worried about batteries calving on us. So the other day we decided, you know what, let's some, we're going to try some videos. So when we did the bike videos, the summer updates and stuff, we used the iPhone. And guess what, guys? The video there turned out pretty freaking good. I mean, it was clear, it was good. You gotta be careful. I was outside natural light. So take it as that. Now the place I work for has gone completely paperless, so all our work orders for uh, mobile equipment repair is now done on the iPad. Let's do that's better. On the iPad. So we're testing that out now. Um, we'll see how it goes. We need to get a new camera mount for it, which we're going to buy the same thing we have right here, except for it'll take a 7 to 11 inch uh, handheld uh tablet ipad candle the whole nine yards right it's just it's generic and it's gonna probably it's you know good 23 bucks it'll mount right to this little stand as well um go from there so guys right there we went one two three fourth camera in four years right so it's amazing how fast you'll you'll rip through gear but anyway dr cranky keep up the great videos guys post the comments how many videos have you or how many cameras have you torn up through doing this stuff all right Adiós.